Hey, just a few minutes before the top of the hour here on Talk AM 1320. 9.53, right around there, and on AM 1320, WKAN. And the crowd really starting to gather here. Yeah, the, the sun's coming out. Oh, that was silly, that cloud cover earlier today. And it, I, I, I kind of liked it. It helped you know, oh, a nice, uh, nice, cool atmosphere. It was but, fine for that. Yeah. But it was silly in that it, uh, it scared people away. Oh, well, you we don't, don't want that to happen. happen. Heavens. <laughs> no but need to scare people. I think the sun away. comes out uh, now. Every week about this time, doesn't it? it just about, yeah. It's, um, yeah, but uh, the crowd is definitely gathering. And, um, um, Steve Emmy's here Steve from Key uh, City Auto. Photographer Steve, Steve Emmy. And uh, he's uh, taking plenty of pictures. I'm going to put these on the website for okay. the uh, Wednesday Wheels in Kankakee. If they're a good looking car around, Steve's going to get his camera out and take pictures of it. <laughs> what kind of tolls are we looking at for the first show? Well, I'm hoping we're going to probably have about 80 cars. Wow. At least. It could be 100. Uh, it's going to depend on a lot on uh, the weather, but it's supposed to be really nice Wednesday, so uh, it's supposed to be another day like this. Perfect. You need to do 100 cars, Carl. Sounds like valet parking job for you. Uh, I'll be there. I will be there. I don't think they'll trust me, though, with some of those cars. See, I would. One of the driving forces behind Wednesday Wheels in uh, Kankakee. This Wednesday, 530, all kicks off, and... Uh, X Country is going to be broadcasting live from the event. Bulls Barbecue is going to be there. A lot of fun will be had. All the above. It'll really be a good time and a, a nice time right around the fountain in front of the depot in downtown Kankakee. Chance to park your car in kind of a picturesque location and uh, enjoy the company of others who enjoy a similar passion of automobiles. I would think we're probably going to have quite a turnout, probably all makes and models. When you have newer cars, maybe cars from the 90s, the 80s, maybe some Monte Carlos, the Palas. Um, you know, I'd sure love to see a new Camaro there. Wouldn't you like to see that, a 2010 Camaro show up? That would, that would be cool. Maybe you've got an angle on that. Maybe I've you know somebody. I've been so hard, but they are all sold. They're, well, that, that means somebody has them, and somebody, somebody wants to show them off, probably. Or uh, I read 14,000 pre-sold. Yeah, that, that that's a good cow. Right on the scene. Wow. Hmm. Well, we'll I mean, I'm, I'm ready. Yeah, what, you know. What more awesome of a picture would it be to have a new Challenger sitting in front of the fountain with the new Camaro next to it, right, right in front of that fountain, in front of the people, just... Hey, they ignoring Mustangs here, Steve. I'm getting nervous. Well, that Mustang's supposed to come out, I think, in the fall. Okay. Yeah, new body. You have a lot of Mustangs out of those 80s, all right. Oh, I would think so, yeah. Well, let me check you guys' credit here, and then we'll see what we can put you in. Hey, there you go. I'm going to talk to my manager. <laughs> I think Larry Nona should have his bike at the car show. Oh, is Larry Nona? Yeah, Larry's here. Yes. Oh, I'm going to bring his bike. in our bike rack. Yeah, Larry should use the bike rack. We have a bike rack here. I think, I think he's taking that bike with him everywhere he goes. I don't think he's going to wag it. Because when you uh, when you push your bike around, you you don't really get you can't buy as much. No, oh, goodness. that's true. This kid bought some kettle corn. It's as as, as big as he is. A lot of yeah, kettle corn really being carried around. When we get those big watermelons in. I don't see him trucking those home on a bike. No, no. But imagine if that kid ate all that kettle corn. That would be a disaster, I would think. Oh, yeah, he's got to face himself. Yeah. So he's going at it pretty good there. Well, Steve Emmy, he's a guy pumped up about uh, Wednesday and the first uh, Wednesday wheels in Kankakee. And um, just reminding people to come on out. Even, you know, I was talking to some people today. I said, well, my car isn't quite show ready right now. When And Steve would say... All cars are show ready. If it'll make it, even if you have to tow it there, um, bring it on in. If you're proud of it, bring it. Uh, if you like it, push it, pull it, whatever you need to do to get it there. Yeah, what, what do the guys say about the tractors? It's in their, their working clothes. It's yeah. not all fancied up yet, maybe, and uh, that's, there's no shame in that. Just come right on in. Bring your, bring your cars, your motorcycles, trucks. Just bring it. Mopeds. Mopeds will be fine. Unicycles. I was going to mention the, the website that we're setting oh, yeah. up there. It's an interactive website, and we need to get uh, some people to join up. It's free to join up, become a member. And you can you can put your own pictures on there and kind of, you know, um, you know, kind of share pictures with other people. Yeah, start your own gallery. Just become a member. Start your own gallery. There's a lot of room for lots of pictures. This is this isn't something just for this month or this this see this is gonna go on for years and years and grow. This show's gonna grow to a five hundred car show. 
Wow. Wow. So that, that's you heard it here first, folks. That's the kind of ambition I need around me. Absolutely. Yeah. We have the flyers here. If you're interested and you're at the yeah. farmer's market, we'll give you a flyer. We've got one on the, the window sheet. Window yeah, here, I, I, know how it I is. try to grab it. I can't get it. And we're going to have a free raffle and give away this Buick if Dennis is listening. <laughs> no, Bring us the title. Yeah, Dennis might have something to say about that. But oh, we didn't tell him yet? Yeah. We haven't mentioned it. We need that title. We need the title, but it is uh, it's 10 o'clock. I don't know if it's a clear title. So uh, we'll, we'll work that out while, muddy title. while the station goes to news. We'll get all those details. Yeah, we'll get the details. Come and look at the Buick, though. We're at the Farmer's Market. <laughs> We're at the Farmer's Market. Larry Known is here, and the Paul Aubrey School of Dance will be taking to the uh, Farmer's Market stage here in just a bit. You're, talk, you're tuned in to Talk AM 1320, WKAN.